aspirants who are preparing for the state level examination of from Punjab University Chandigarh have to make sure that they are well aware with the examination pattern and syllabus for PU SEC UG. So if you want to head over to get an admission into the prestigious universities in Punjab, well, you should be aware about how you have to patronize your preparation in accordance with the marking scheme as well as the various topics that are considered for preparation. With that note, I would welcome you all to this video. And in this video, we are going to know about PU set UG examination pattern and syllabus, everything consigned in one space. So all you have to do is head over to exams.preciousnow.com to get all of the information very conveniently. So first I'm going to show you step by step as to how you can reach this essential information with a convenient go. Head over to Google and search for PU set UG syllabus freshest now. So as you search you can see the first link itself is from exams.freshers now. Give a click on this and this particular page will be opening up for you further. So once if you give a click, PU set UG syllabus page would be opening up, starting off with a basic introduction and here you have the brief outlook as to how the examination is going to look like. So this examination would be conducted in physics, chemistry, biology and mathematics. The duration of the examination is 70 minutes and the exam is conducted for 120 marks for each of the subject. So this is the basic credential that you have to be knowing. Next off, you will be further heading over to the in-depth overview and also the syllabus part. Before we head over to the exam pattern modules, I would like to request you all to join our telegram channel. Through telegram, you are going to get all of the updates or the latest information regarding entrance exams at one space. So don't forget to join us. Also click on the subscribe button below. By subscribing to our channel, you would be staying in update to all of our latest videos regarding entrance exams. Now heading over to the overview part, as I've mentioned, this is from Punjab University Chandigarh, the board of conducting head. And the examination is Punjab University Common Entrance Test. The examination is conducted via online. And here you have the official website access where you can cross check the information or any details if you want to do so. And here you have this examination purpose, which is for admission to BSc Honours, the choice base credit system and B Pharmacy at Punjab University campus. So this is uh, as considered as a state level examination, you would be accessing courses under for undergraduation. Heading over to the examination pattern. So as you can see, we have four subjects for the exam, physics, chemistry, biology and mathematics. There will be 60 questions in each of the following carrying 120 marks for each. There will be 70 minutes given for each of the particular subject and further this would be the examination conducting pattern. Now heading over to the syllabus part for each of the subject starting off with mathematics there are various other topics that you can consider right from starting with the fundamentals or uh, starting with your shortcuts or formulae some of the topics that you have to prioritize on your preparation basis are as follows sets, relations and functions, trigonometric functions, algebra, principles of mathematical induction, complex numbers and quadratic equations, linear inequalities, permutations and combinations, binomial theorems, sequences and series, straight line, conic sections, introduction to three-dimensional geometry, limits and derivations, mathematical reasoning, statistics, probability, coordinate geometry, calicus, vectors, linear programming, and next subject is physics. For physics, you have for starting from the basics or the basics use of physics. You will be heading over to the physical world and measurement, kinematics, loss of motion, work energy and power, oscillations and waves, electrostatic properties of bulk matter. Then you have thermodynamics, current electricity, then magnetic effects of current and magnetism, motion of systems of particles, 
behavior of perfect gas and kinematics, electromagnetic induction and alternating currents, electromagnetic waves, optics, dual nature of matter and radiation, atoms and nuclei, electronic devices and communication systems. Now that's for physics. Next for the subject of chemistry, starting with the basic concepts again, you would be heading over to the basic and the most fundamental one which is structure of atoms. Then classification of elements, cl uh, chemical bonding and the molecular structures, hydrogen and all of the block elements as well as their groups and families which are combined. Then you have status of matter, then thermodynamics equilibrium, redox reactions and uh, you have all the block elements which I have already mentioned, hydrocarbons, environmental chemistry. Next off we have subject for biology. Diversity in living world, structural organization in animals, reproduction, genetics and evolution, cell structures and its function, plant physiology, human anatomy and physiology, biology and human welfare, biotechnology and its application, ecology and its environment. So that's all for this under the syllabus section. We have covered for all of the subjects. I hope you have taken down and hope you have not missed out on any. If you have any other questions on this or if you have any other queries regarding this, don't forget to place them in the comment section below. Also go through the description box because all of the important links regarding this could be placed down there. So don't forget to check it out. Thank you so much for watching and also I request you all to subscribe to our channel Precious Now for more informative videos like this.